Hello, good day, welcome. So today we're going to be looking at Bechet 2018 Basic Science Past Question, Question 27. The importance of skill acquisition includes the following except A. Encourage individuals to learn B. Help in self-employment C. Improve the quality of life and D. Increase the dependence on government. Now we are asked to find out of this option the one that is not an importance of skill acquisition. And like we know, skill acquisition simply means what getting. It just simply means getting or obtaining skill. Getting or obtaining skill. And like we know, this skill what this skill varies. This skill varies. This skill acquisition can either be formal or informal. It can either be formal or informal. An example of the formal one is what like the school that we go to. In our school, we attend school to what to acquire skills. The university we go to, we go to the university to specialize in different what in different courses. Acquisition of skill that's the formal. Then the informal is the one like the um the uh, like for uh, instance now going to like learn tailoring. All these are informal learning tailoring or what mechanic workshops. But all these things involves what self um, skill what acquisition it still involves skill acquisition now we are asked that which of these is not an importance of skill acquisition now a here says what encourage individuals to learn and like we know skill acquisition involves what learning once you acquire skill you're learning and our everyday life deals with what deals with learning so actually skill acquisition will encourage individuals to learn it will enable you to learn more because the more you acquire skill the more you learn the more you learn so a is an importance of skill acquisition then b says help in self-employment help in self-employment and like i told you skill acquisition simply means what obtaining skills obtaining skills acquiring skills now when you acquire these skills what do you have you now put these skills into practice you put these skills you put the skills into practice let me give you an instance now and like i told you I say this skill acquisition is in the formal way and the informal way. Now let's say for instance in the formal way now. Let's say for instance now in a university you studied fishery. You studied fishery in the university. Fishery. And like we know fishery simply means what? The acts of growing or rearing with fishes. Now you study fishery and then as you finish from the university, you set up what's a fish pond and you begin to rear fish and you begin to sell this fish. Now what happened? You've employed yourself. That's what the self-employment means. You've employed yourself. You've employed yourself. Self-employment. So it's that skill acquisition actually was help you what in self-employment. You don't need to depend on others for job. You've employed yourself. Also in the informal way. Take for instance, you learn tailoring. After learning it and you re I receive your freedom, what happened? You begin to you begin to sew clothes for people and begin to earn money. So that is what self-employment. So self-employment is an importance of skill acquisition. Now see here says what improve the quality of living. Yes skill acquisition has helped improve the quality of living it has improved the quality of living the aspect of technology you go to a computer um, site or you learn computer in school now this computer and um, knowledge that you have this computer skill you have has improved your lot your, your your quality life it has turned what it has turned our uh, what's hard labor it has turned our hard labor to what easy labor Make this very easy. So skill acquisition has actually helped to what improve the quality of life. It has improved the quality of life because when you acquire skill and you employ yourself and make money, what happens? Your quality of life will increase. Your standard of living will increase because what you don't depend on others for money. So your standard of living will increase. Then D here says what? Increase the dependence on the government. Now skill acquisition will not increase the dependence of the government. It's not an importance. This increase depends on the government on importance. This simply means that what you solely you solely depend on the government. You solely depend on the government of the states. Which is what which is not an importance of skill acquisition because one who depends on the government will not what employ himself. The person will be waiting for white collar job from the government. You won't what you won't apply the, the person won't apply the skills he learns. Like take for instance now maybe you learned fishery you start to apply this and uh, fishery to make money you won't apply it you wait you're waiting on the government for white collar jobs so 
increase the dependence of government is not an importance of skill acquisition. Like we said, in, um, encouraging learning is an importance, self-employment is an importance, and even the improving of quality of health is an importance of life. But the increase in dependence of government is not an importance of skill acquisition. Because once you acquire skill, you won't want to rely on the government for job. So our answer here now is what D is D. Because the question says the importance of skill acquisition include the following except. So all these here are importance of skill acquisition except D. So our answer is D. Thank you very much and God bless you. Please ensure you subscribe to our channel for more videos.